Y'all, we are... We found the spot. Camping. Yeah. <laughs> We're going camping this weekend. It is Saturday. Uh, we wanted to come out Friday and Saturday, but we had some rain, which has been great. Thank goodness. I mean, literally, thank you, Lord, for the rain. So but we're here. We're going to be camping this weekend. Yeah. The rain cooled everything off. It's been 100 and miserable in Texas for the last several months. So the first weekend that it actually like feels good, I think right now it's like 69 out. Um Anyway, so we are, we have completely bought it. We're, we're going to be like professional campers, so follow along because we're <laughs> yeah, <the game laughs> going to be changing. doing this for a long... New uh, hobby acquired. Yeah, we'll be doing this for a while, for the rest of the year probably. Yeah. Um, but we found like literally one of the most beautiful spots I think I've ever seen in Texas. Um, it's pretty perfect, so yeah. we're going to show you. So let's have fun. Whoop! <laughs> You think it's fine if I just connect them to your cooler? Yeah. How was breakfast? Maybe so good. I love scrambled eggs and bacon, but when you cook the scrambled eggs in the bacon grease, it's
Okay, we have full stomachs. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna go try to find a trail. I would consider this a trail. <laughs> <laughs> the paved road. It's not paved. The road we came in on. It's just driven on. We need a trail. Dex. Dex, come. Come. And y'all, we did miss this sign when we were coming in. The seasonal road is closed to motor vehicles from September 15 to March 15. Yeah, what is today? Clearly missed it. Today's the 16th, I think. We don't know. We've been off the grid so long. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Those guys came in, some forest guys came in and told us the gate up front was supposed to be closed. It wasn't. That was on them. Um, so we're good to stay the night here with the truck, but tomorrow we got to move it, which will be out by then, but yeah, thankfully we missed the sign and the gate was open. So we got it and we weren't the only people down here. Y'all, I feel like, so guys can do this all day long. Camping, it, like mo more girls don't, more girls should go camping. The problem is when you camp and there's no bathroom set up, you're kind of up shit creek. Um, so we left so early i wasn't able to use the restroom this morning so now clay has to go dig a hole that's like policy so this is a first for me uh like i can't not use it <laughs> no why would you not not use it well, no, it's just... yeah, you can't not not use it so it's natural it's natural and it's etiquette to just bury it What are you doing? Making sure that fucking truck ain't coming down here. Setting up a booby trap. How did you get that up there? What? How did you get that up there? You just threw it? Yeah. For the trash. It's for the trash. Hmm. Smart. I don't think you need it. I think that's for bears, but uh, I don't really want any raccoons or anything coming to us. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah. All right. What do you? So what do you think? I like it. Here's the thing, though. What do you do? What else do you do? What do you do all day? What do you do when you can't? It's 11:30, and I'm trying to figure out how to take a nap. And there's no, like, these are not. These are shit chairs. You can't recline, lean back. You can't prop your feet up. The poor dogs miss their couch. I miss the couch. It's the second season, third. second, third week in college football, and we're already missing it well the texas game warden came by again well this time the game warden first it was three forest guys then it was the warden game warden she came by and also said hey the gate is closed nobody's really supposed to be back here so just yeah fyi which we do kind of feel i don't i don't guess we feel bad but it's like we're already set we would move if it wasn't such a pain in the butt to I don't know how we would move or where we would. It's okay, so here's the deal. You can be here, it's your vehicle. Like like Clay would have to take his truck where wherever, how far is that, two and a half miles? No, if we knew that the gate was closed, we wouldn't have come back here, period. Yeah. And that's it. But you can technically be here, it's just your motor vehicle that cannot be, which I think is so interesting. But he also said this was a high traffic drug area, so. <laughs> yeah, on he Wednesday. Us, he asked us if we saw some drug paraphernalia because he arrested someone here Wednesday, which makes me feel really safe. We got more ants.
We're having a cheese and cracker snack. Is there a knife in that little set? Right there. Put on that. Run right there and watch your head. Ignore that dirty trash. That's ridiculous that people are like that. Yeah, if you come in, clean your shit up. It's not your part, dude. Thank you, big as him. Like that, bud? <laughs> It's sprinkling, just sprinkling. Starting to sprinkle a little bit. Feels really nice, but it's not gonna rain. Just sprinkling. Yeah, but we wanna put cloth things up. Ow. Yeah. This is why you get a big tent, because if you're in a position where you got to be in it for more than just sleeping, we're really comfortable. I'd say we're comfortable. And the dogs would agree. Yeah. Like, we're just chilling, the door's open, and it's right. Hey, Bobby. Hey, Bo. You see those big old short long eyes? I'll say the good thing about the rain is now you don't really have to worry now about somebody creeping or look, lurking around in the woods because yeah, it's wet, yeah. which is good. <laughs> not that anybody would, but nobody is now. I wasn't even concerned about that until that game one showed up. Talking about the drugs? Yeah, I'm like a total bliss. I just, I don't want to be around people. Well, yeah, if nobody... They even if they don't mean any harm, it's like, you just, like people do stupid shit. 
Oh yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're gonna hang out and wait for supper. I could take a nap. Dex is already there. Dex was made for this lifestyle. Yeah. Me. Me too. Yeah. Cool. Get the second half kick off, and as that fan probably has the same reaction that maybe the. So I know we're camping, <laughs> but we had to check on those dogs. The D A W G S. Them dogs. Hush. I'm not talking about you. No. You're French Bulldog. Yeah. Not everything's about you. But the rain has slowed down. It's sprinkling a little bit. It's 4 o'clock. Fish just ate some food. That fish. <laughs> yeah. There's been one there all day hopping up and getting some. Yeah. We got, last night, I think I was in bed. I was about to doze off. Thinking about, oh, I'm going to pack the fishing poles tomorrow. And then we got over the bridge here. And I was like, ah, oh, dang, forgot the fishing poles. Been perfect out there. Yeah. Next time. Yeah, we are, like, on a really good spot to catch fish. The damn fishing boat's been right here all day. All of them. Okay, the rain has officially fully, I think fully stopped. <clears throat> We're gonna make some supper. That is hot. Okay, the fajita meat already marinated cut probably not supposed to cut it but cut marinated ready to cook Mm. pepper though mm. <clears throat> damn we just demolished those fajitas that meat was so tender what do you think what do you think that's why i'm having to pick it out of my teeth yeah it was so tender well we're just gonna pretty much hang out for a little bit you know like i said the sun came back out it's still beautiful <clears throat> chairs are soaked so we can't sit here but we got our two inch tv over there we're just chilling mm-hmm 
All right, y'all. So it's been a day, a day or a couple of days. It's been a couple of days since we went camping. Uh, we were in Sam Houston National Forest, beautiful park. Uh, definitely recommend anybody go check it out. I mean, it's massive. Uh, you'll never see or stay in the same spot twice if you kind of get out of maybe your comfort zone and go explore, uh, which we didn't have the opportunity to. You know, like we said, there was about four times, four servicemen, game wardens, and then just like law enforcement trucks. I don't know what branch or division or agency, whatever they were part of, but they kept coming up and down that road over and over all night. So we really had no choice but to leave that spot. Yeah. Um, you know, it was unfortunate. We definitely wanted to hang out there for the night. I mean, it was kind of our fault. We did miss the sign that said, like y'all saw, well, I mean, they didn't have the gate shut. Yeah, they didn't. It, so it was their fault, but also we chose to stay, and I'm, which I'm super glad that we did. It was yeah. awesome. It was beautiful. But when it came down to leaving, we were like, we got to pack up and get out. And now. then it wasn't an enjoyable thing. Yeah. Nonetheless, it was still a great time. Um, and that's really all we wanted to say. I don't know why we feel like we need to justify it. So maybe well, because we it, we, it's just like stops that you know. Like oh we yeah, eating, the video just yeah, stops. We were just yeah, eating yeah, dinner yeah, yeah. and then. So we want to round it out. Yeah. Beautiful spot. We yeah. will be going to future spots. We don't know where, but uh, you know, just stick yeah, around. Our, sorry. Go ahead. Our content is going to change a bit. Yeah. Well, you know, you're not really. You don't have to self put yourself into one spot, relegate yeah. yourself to one division of YouTube. Um, but yeah, stay tuned for some, you know, camping things. I want to do some reviews on some stuff uh, that we do have and, uh, you know, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So until then. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Hope we'll see you, you next time. Enjoyed it. Be sure to like and subscribe.